Hi, thanks for joining us today to learn more about the Student Alumni Network, also known as SAN. My name is Jessica and I'm from Heston, Kansas, and I recently graduated from KU. One of my favorite organizations I was involved with at KU is the Student Alumni Network. And I'm excited to share with you what the KU Alumni Association is about and how to get involved with SAN. One of my favorite events from my time with SAN was the Student Leader Dinner, which was a dinner where SAN invited leaders from different campus organizations to get to know one another and celebrate their accomplishments. So before we get started, I'm gonna let a few more people introduce themselves. Hey everyone, I'm Jenna. I am a senior at KU this year and I'm from the Chicago area. And I would say one of my favorite memories from the SAN is taking a behind the scenes tour of Allen Fieldhouse. So we were able to be in a small little group um, and go into the um, locker rooms. We were in kind of behind the scenes, got to see the practice court. That was really fun, um, but I'll be back in just a minute to talk more about how you can learn about KU and start connecting with classmates and alumni. Hey all, my name is Acho and I'm a junior at KU. Um, I'm from India. One of my favorite um, events at KU is the Hawkfest, which I was able to attend because of my involvement with Student Alumni Network. The cool thing about SAN is that it's the largest student organization with over 6,000 members in it. And it offers countless leadership opportunities like managing events, planning events, volunteering on campus, and access to events with some really cool alumni. Um, some of the other events you can look forward to by joining SAN are the Finals Center, which is a great thing to have when you have big finals coming in, um, networking events with alumni to make those big connections and access to virtual programming delivered to your inbox um, as in as emails. And now I'm going to hand it back to Jenna to tell you more about one of the coolest parts of SAN, which is our KU mentoring platform. Thanks, Achal. I'm super excited to share a little bit more about KU mentoring. So you can sign up for KU mentoring today by going to mentoring.ku.edu. And what this platform is, is it's kind of, I like to describe it to my friends as the LinkedIn of um, KU. So you'd be able to, able to create your own profile page and tag all the things you're interested in, whether that be your major or other organizational interests that you have. And once you've built your profile, the platform will automatically recommend some alumni for you to connect with based on the information you've provided. The cool thing is all of the alumni in KU mentoring are here to help you. You can reach out to them for advice on how to get involved on campus, they can review your resume, you can do mock interviews, and there's so much more that they're willing to help you with. The best part is if you sign up for KU Mentoring, you're automatically a part of SAN. But we still recommend you download our app to stay up to date with all things SAN. I'm gonna turn it back to Jessica to talk a little bit more about how to get the app and some other great benefits of SAN. Hey all, you heard from Michelle and Jenna about some of the leadership opportunities and benefits of joining SAN. And like Jenna mentioned, we do have an app to make joining and staying in the know about SAN events super easy. So pull out your phone, go to the app store and search for KU Alumni Association. Once you've downloaded the app, click on the register tile, choose KU student, it's the first option, enter your first and last name. If your name appears on the list, click it, then enter your seven digit student ID to log in. If you don't see your name on the list, click the don't see yourself button, then complete registration steps on the next screen, and you'll be all set. As if you don't have enough reasons to join already, here are a few other things you can look forward to by becoming an SAN member. Freebies and free food. Trust me, SAN is always giving out free food. You can look forward to getting some local Lawrence favorites like Merchants, Papa Kinos, Salty Guana, and many more on almost all of our events. And yeah, the freebies are cool too. We have SAN notebooks, stickers, buttons, scarves, and t-shirts. Once you become a member, be sure to check out your email for a weekly SAN e-news that gives you all the important upcoming info for events around campus. This is also where you can check out how to get your free SAN t-shirt. You can also check us out on social media at KU Student Alumni to stay up to date on what SAN has going on. Before we wrap things up, Achal, Jenna, and I want to give you a few more tips on how to make KU feel like home. Achal, what's your favorite tradition at KU that you think every student should check out? 
my favorite tradition at KU is the Hawkfest, um, which happens almost in the first week of your time at KU. And it's my favorite because it's it's a great event planned by the First Year Experience Office, which exposes all the KU incoming students to um, the resources on, and all those new people they're going to be around for the next four years. So yeah, Hawkfest is just a great tradition KU has. Great. I know my favorite thing about being a Jayhawk is a strong community Jayhawks have with one another. Jenna, what's yours? Um, I would say just the Jayhawk mascot and identity in general. So it is the only place in the world where you can be a Jayhawk. Um, so I like to think about that and everything that it encompasses. Um, but I also love the Rock Chalk chant just because of how far it really reaches. Um, I was in the Barcelona airport once and was able to hear someone Rock Chalk me just because I had a Jayhawk on my hat. So that really means a lot. I know we talked a little bit about food earlier, but Achal and Jenna, what are your favorite places to eat on campus? My favorite place to eat on campus is the De Bruce Center, where they have the Courtside Cafe. Um, it's just a great place, very convenient on campus, and pretty nutritious and tasty food there. Um, for me, I would say the Kansas Union, because there is a Chick-fil-A inside, so um, the Union gets a lot of my money and a lot of my time. <laughs> Those are both great. I really liked eating at Mrs. E's as a freshman on the hill. That will always hold such a special place in my heart. Well, I think that about wraps it up for us. Don't forget to download the KU Alumni Association app and register to be an SAN member today. If you have any questions about SAN, feel free to reach out to us or tweet SAN at KU Student Alumni. Thanks for watching and rock chalk. Rock chalk.